Hello, thank you for watching this short video. My name is Brother Sean, and I'm a member of the Teo community of Interfaith Franciscans. A community that is online, it's a cyber community of ordinary men and women who are living a spiritual life, coming from different faith groups, but living the lay monastic life from their own home, and some actually still work in the world. It's a simple life, and we follow a simple rule, and it's rooted very much in the teachings of Francis of Assisi, for he embraced all faiths. And he left us a legacy of love, to reach out in the name of love through the natural world and find one's God. And I come to you today with a reflection. It's a reflection for the heart, not the head. And it reads, I love you regardless of, well, of how well you're performing. This is the cosmic Christ speaking to our heart. Sometimes you feel uneasy, wondering if you are doing enough to be worthy of my love. No matter how exemplary your behavior, the answer to the question will always be no. Your performance and my love are totally different issues which you need to sort out. I love you with an everlasting love that flows out from eternity without limits or conditions. I have clothed you in the robe of my righteousness and this is an eternal transaction. Nothing and no one can reverse it. Therefore, your accomplishment as a Christian or believer has no bearing on my love for you. Even your ability to assess how well you are doing on a given day, it is flawed. Your limited human perspective and the condition of your body with its mercurial variations distort your evaluations. Bring your performance anxiety to me and receive in its place my unfailing love. Try to stay conscious of my loving presence with you in all that you do and I will direct your steps. Those words are channeled words from the cosmic Christ to your heart. And today many hearts are closed and Christ consciousness is a heart consciousness. We have entered a new period of time in our evolution. We have entered a time of enlightenment where we are allowed not to process in our head, but to come to the truth from our heart. Simply put, I believe your heart is your teacher. Your heart will always speak to you a message from God, for it is a conduit. It is another vehicle that the Supreme uses to connect with the I Am Presence within you. Every child of God, of all faiths and none, are welcome to come and listen to the voice of the Cosmic Christ. For he does not bring a religion. He brings a new understanding about the Supreme and the importance of loving oneself, embracing one's truth. But to reawaken your heart is a must. And you do that by making times for stillness. When is it the last time you sat and switched off the mind? We need times to retreat from the busyness of the world, 
from texting and using mobiles, the iPhone and the iPad, can we not just make a few minutes each day to be still, to listen to our heart, speak to us the language of love, God's voice. Surrender your heart to the Supreme and listen to that message that you are loved regardless of who you are and what you've done, that you are a precious child of God. Allow those words resonate now as you just reflect in your heart that you are a beloved of God. And you are called by your name to embrace your truth, to speak your truth, to honor your truth, to live by your truth. Namaste. Shalom, inshallah, paikset bonum, om shanti. Solo de Caritas, and may the peace of your God direct your heart, for therein is the peace of God, a peace that transcends all understanding. It is an awesome peace, and you are invited to embrace it. Bless you.